Well, hello there. Welcome to another break here from Bounty Hunter Breaks. This is Boba Femi. And, yep, this is a surprise Monday break. So, these are the new 2023 Star Wars Chrome Galaxy. Uh, Pre-ordered. I'm trying to remember now if it was around uh, July 4th. Somewhere around there. But anyway. So they just started shipping last week, and mine arrived today. I know I saw a video of somebody else who already did a break of one box that they must have ordered and got their pre-order before me, but I'm sure there's lots of people that did. So, again, I do like the cover art of the box featuring me, Boba Fett. But the layout is kind of a bummer because it is less packs. I think this is the same though as last year, but I didn't get any last year because it was just ridiculous for the past couple of years. So there's three rows. You got Ray artwork on the cover. And I should point out that there's a giant chunk of cardboard in the bottom of the box so at least there's actually it's not just uh let's say is it it looks like two pieces of cardboard that they glued together because you can see the the difference in the corrugation but anyway we are going to get into it we're going to try to enjoy it for what it is, so I want to flip these over so that that way, start with front to back. So here we go. Now, I don't know if I didn't really show it off quickly, or I know I kind of did the box rather quickly, but. They're guaranteed three numbered parallels, which looks like I got one right in the first pack, along with a refractor, or yeah, just a base refractor. But I believe this one here is the 40th anniversary poster art. Oh no, it is not. It is just a because it says Return of the Jedi, and you've got Emperor. Luke, Vader, Chewbacca, and an Emperor's Guard, and then down at the bottom, it looks like you got Jabba's Palace, an Atstad on Endor, and then an Ewok Village. So anyway, there's that. And we do have, looks like Ewok's attacking Stormtrooper Overrun. And this, the other thing that I kind of noticed when the other person did theirs was that no inclusion of the artist who did the actual artwork on the front of the card yet again. So, extremely disappointed there that Tops is not giving the artist credit. So here's a cool insert. We'll do the one on the back. Got Chewbacca and Droid plan in action. I seem to remember that one because that's with Luke and Han. But the Return of the Jedi poster insert, and it's a X Fractor, and apparently X Fractors are numbered to ten, and this one is. Number 10 of 10. So at least something of significance to start with. And that was all just pack one. So it's all downhill from here. 
that stats on the prowl more at stats marching at stats that looks like an artwork from last jedi face the dark side refractor and then a reimagined art That is also, even though it's not stamped refractor on the back, it is a refractor like parallel, but I'm not a fan of the, the shadow border. That's kind of a little, it kind of really messes up the look of the border. So the thing is, it makes it look like everything's severely off center. Vader holding on to Obi-Wan's lightsaber. Remnants of Kenobi. Ah, we got Kenobi and Yoda. Masters of the Force. Han Frozen and Carbonite Refractor. He's all yours, Bounty Hunter. And another Yoda in his home on Dagobah. Night must fall. Now on to the next. This one feels a little bit thicker, so probably a parallel here. Nope. But we do have two refractors. We got Han and the Stormtroopers. Ooh, this one's like a Rogue One. I like the looks of that one. Dawn of the Rebellion. That'd be nice to get in a parallel. The Captain Captured. Luke leaving. Or maybe it's just when... Actually, it's when Yoda's... Raising the X-Wing out of the swamp. Do or do not. And then we have another. Oh, this is uh, Darth Vader in the Bounty Hunters art cards. So now that one doesn't look as bad with that shadow border. But again, I'm still not a fan of that. I would have not recommended to go that route there's a nice looking one and of course the edge is bent it's like the foil got crunched up but traveling to the new Death Star, and I did get a parallel of it. Cool. Dawn of the Rebellion. And then, of course, oh, uh, didn't I? Did I get that as a parallel? Oh, I did, okay. So I'm not so upset that I got this again because this is the base. And then the same thing as the do or do not. It's like get it as a refractor, get it as the base. That's a nice looking one too. Collecting my bounty. Vespin bounty hunter. Night must fall. Refractor. Return of the Jedi. Poster. And then it looks like we got that same art. I want to say I had the parallel of it already, but there's the one from Last Jedi. Face the dark side. Or face of the dark side. Parallel number two. 
Mojo. Got a Yoda. Wise Yoda. Well, that's definitely artwork from Galaxy 3. Gamorrean Guard. Charge! Java's Palace and our Mojo is going to be Han and Chewie. And that's number to 50. Sneaking around danger. And the, the Mojo pattern is not quite through the entire image. I mean, it kind of is subtly in the background here, but it's not jumping out at you like it did. I want to say on, was it last year's? Again, I didn't buy any, but I want to say I saw some breaks of it. I guess I should go a little faster. There's probably card number one. No, card 37. From the depths, but it's the box art. A refractor of... That's like Rogue One. Storming Rebels. A Tauntaun and Luke. Predator and Prey. And then, of course, a different iteration of the Do or Do Not lifting the X-Wing. something here another insert possibly Ooh, that's a cool poster Star Wars with a triangle just like back home and that same one that I got just a minute ago as the parallel I want to say maybe not yeah I guess it was the mojo right back there and then a refractor of X-Wings flying over the water. And then this must be another one of those Vader's bounty hunters. Indeed it is. A Bosk. Hopefully I can get myself out of those. Instead of having to find it online or eBay. Oh, we got something here, too. Uh, Atomic. That's like a, one of the shots from Force Awakens. Attack on T Tokendana there. Veda and all the clones. The Emperor's Forces. See that looks, the back looks, looks horrible there. Ewoks attacking the stormtroopers and the atomic to one fifty. And this one here is ambush from above. But the Death Star two with the Millennium Falcon and I do see some X-Wings, Star Destroyer, TIE Fighters. That's 40 of 150, so that's the highest numbered parallel. And we're not even, or we're just over halfway, I want to say. So unless I get a bonus hit, that's all of them. No speeder. Daybreak on Hoth. Is that supposed to be? That's not the Rancor. Or not Rancor, sorry, the Wampa. It is a, a Wampa. Wild Wampa. That looks nothing like the Wampa. And we have. I think that's the first one I've seen of that. The 
Galactic Visions. So I was wondering what that signal, but the thing it looks like it's from Visions, the animated anthology that they did. And it looks like it's still from the first year. Incoming transmission. Vader. Vader would like to have a chat. Cool image of the light coming through the forest. Our wild wampa again. Our stormtrooper overrun. And the plan. Refractor. Lost. Emperor. Refractor. Hey, it's Sabine. That's the first one I've seen of that. That's the women of Star Wars. And it looks like we have. What is that? Wading through the swamp. It doesn't even look like Luke. But I guess, I guess maybe. It doesn't quite look like Luke, but. Down to the what? Last five. Mando and Grogu. That one looks like almost a friggin' photo. As good as that is, that's something like Carlos would do. Maul. There's an old one from Empire of Luke. Being trained by Yoda and then having a vision of Vader. Weight of Destiny. And that's another. You got Akbar, B Wings. From the Eyes of the Admiral Refractor. Chewie, embattled Han and Chewie. Oh, I guess I need to see Han buried there. Hey, another Boba Fett. Galaxy's most dangerous. And Vader. Carbonite chamber duel. And Luke is just a shadow. <laughs> Last three. I really didn't think this was going to take this long, but let's see if we have a Rancor, Kylo Ren, Dark Order, Ravenous Rancor, a Young Jedi's Stance. That's supposed to be Luke. Interesting. And it looks like there's also another Women of Star Wars insert. Got Ray lifting rocks. Nothing here. There's an older one with a T-16 Skyhopper. Biggers Canyon Run, The Kiss, Ooh, Vader's Helmet, For what does it say? Forged in Darkness, Forced in Darkness. I'm sure it's titled The Kiss. Oh no, The Princess in the Scoundrel. Nice bounty acquired. Oh, 
Okay, last pack. Last chance for anything. A bonus. An auto. Sketch. Extra hit. Does not look like any of the kind. So here we have Han and Chewie and what's left of 3PO on Upset Wookie. That's a nice poster. Stormtroopers. Pin down. Now is this another Jedi? No, it's not. The one behind it is though. The dark side refractor. And the last card is going to be the original teaser poster for the third film, episode six, Revenge of the Jedi. Poster card. So you do get quite a bit of shiny stuff in a box. So here's all the non-numbered inserts slash refractors. You get the Revenge of the Jedi poster, the Dark Side refractor, the Bounty Acquired, the Women of Star Wars insert of Rey lifting rocks, a Luke Skywalker training, Refractor, Vader, Carbonite Chamber Duel, the, from the eyes of the Admiral, another Refractor of Marching At Stats, other Women of Star Wars, insert is going to be a Sabine Wren, I like that kind of artwork on that one, the, a Plan in Action, we got one of the Visions inserts. The Wild Wampa. The X-Wings. Our Bounty Hunter. Insert of Bosk. The Rebels. Storming Rebels. And then Night Must Fall. Our 40th Anniversary Poster Art. That's two of those. You got the Dawn of the Rebellion Refractor. The Do or Do Not Refractor. Another Bounty Hunter insert was the Stormtrooper. Which seems bizarre, but anyway. The Frozen and Carbonite, or He's All Yours Bounty Hunter. Face the Dark Side. Oh, this one was also Visions, so I had two. It says Reimagined Art, though. Did it say that on the other one? Oh, yeah, okay. That's the title of the actual image. Because Art of the Duel was the first one. And then our last refractor, Stormtrooper Overrun. So, like I say, you get quite a few base refractors. But, uh, huge... Pulls of the box, and I thought I had it in the correct order, but I did not, but I do now. So I had the 40 of 150 Atomic Refractor of Battle of Endor. Chewie and Han and the Stormtroopers. And that's a Mojo 28 of 50, sneaking around danger. And then the hit of the box would be... It was in the very first pack it was the Return of the Jedi poster X Fractor 10 of 10. So I don't know if they have reds or not, but the thing is, if they do, then the only thing lower number than the, that X Fractor would be the red or the one of one super. Anyway, that concludes this box break of 2023. Top Star Wars Chrome Galaxy. If you made it all the way through, you're a trooper. But anyway, 
Hope you all have a great rest of your day, and as always, keep collecting.